I'm Glenny Goosey 60 this is my 85th Diablo 2 Let's Play video. I think I did that in the wrong order. But, as promised, I am back. I've resummoned my henchmen, and I'm ready to go through the portal to try and retrieve some gear, which I lost when I was killed by a Death Lord. My corpse is over here. Despite the fact it's not showing on the map for whatever reason. There it is. There are enemies through there. Oh, let's play for a minute, will eh? Corpse. I feel like I'm playing the weirdest game of tag ever now. <laughs> smashy smashy. There we go. Right. Just restart my potions. I bought a new set when I was in town. I really felt like I was going to need it. There's probably an auto-fill potions key, but I just haven't looked it up. I probably should. Eh, alas. I digress on that matter. Um, right. <laughs> now I think I can safely advance up here. Because I think I killed everything last time. Eh, maybe not. The presence of enemies would definitely suggest not is a more uh, valuable answer, but I, I'm willing to debate on that point. I just killed my vine and it made a noise like a pig. Okay, uh, a little weirded out by that, I have to say. It can make a noise if it wants, it just shouldn't be a pig noise. That's a fairly reasonable request. Right, this is leading up to the throne room, to my knowledge. Unless, of course, this throne room is invisible and actually to the south. Which would make for a much more secure throne room, I have to say. Many, many less problems of adventurers coming in to, you know, smash up your stuff and kill your minions and get all up in your grill and that stuff. There's a reason why I don't try and talk next to them. It's a good reason. Ah, dire wolves, you're the only ones who truly care or are able to survive. There's a pill. But, fortunately, he doesn't react to me. He just cackles like that and then summons some minions I may have to talk to him first, I don't remember no, I don't have to talk to him he's just going to summon he basically summons one really tough enemy from every act so this time it's the fallen ones and shamans with someone called that was Colonzo the Annihilator sounds like a weird clown who likes to kill things in his spare time uh, next, I believe it's uh, Act 2, which is the weird tall things with the masks and some undead warriors to go with them. They're vulnerable to cold. Also, they're poisonous. I believe Act 3 is some council members. Uh, the ones I fought in Tristan. Tristan. No, that wasn't Tristan. That was... It was somewhere. Also, those enemies were called Unravelers, apparently. I am really badly poisoned. There's no antidotes around here, is there? No, of course not. That'd be helpful. Why did I bother? I'm going to use it anyway. Right. Charge back in. Yeah, look, some council members. Bartuk the Bloody. there appears to be only one magical council member, the rest are just, you know, generic council members who are still relatively painful to fight. All my henchmen are dead, aren't they? Would appear that way. Ow, 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 okay. And here's where clearing out the area comes in handy. I have to admit, I hate lightning and shining enemies. They're, they're just, they're awful to try and kill. They end up doing more damage to you than you do to them. It's worse than Iron Maiden stuff. Okay. Right. 
small problem and I let a big problem remaining. We summon a full set of henchmen. Not going to go back and resurrect the actual henchman because he was only annoying me. He wasn't actually serving a purpose. He being a meat shield. That's not really a purpose, so. Uh, level 4 is uh, a bunch of those uh, demon lord things. The ones that spew toxins or venom lords. So presumably they spew venom. And then just keep running in circles and everything will be fine. I'm slowly injuring them. And eventually they should start falling over dead. As long as I never get caught in the middle of them. Almost happened just there. <laughs> okay, there's now a lot less of them. Correctly, the level 5 enemies are a nightmare to kill. So I'm gonna go and resurrect everything, apart from the actual henchmen, because I really can't be bothered going to town right now. Although, to be fair, I probably should, because I'm running out of potions. Yeah, I'm going back to town. Hello. Ah, buy those. That was a lot of money I just spent on potions, and resurrect the henchmen. And then we'll go back out and try and deal with the more immediate problem of the... I forget what their names are, but they're I think they're called grotesques. Which probably says more than I can. Or at the very least, it would use the same words I would use to describe them. Right. I believe he summons a lot of them and it really is a case of taking them out one by one. There is no other way to take them out. Minion of Destruction, that's the thing. I'm summoning wolves instead of uh, hurricanes. They really are awful to try and destroy. I won't be able to do that much longer. No, there we go. Now they're on to me. As you can see, the, the actual damage done to them is minimal. The easiest way is to try and lure them out, to take them on one by one, if possible. But it isn't always possible to do so, because they have a mind of their own. They can do whatever the hell they like. Oh god, list of the torment. Right, okay, can one of you follow me? Just one. Please? Any of them following me? There we go. We got one and it's a minion. That's good. Wow, they really are more resilient than I remembered. Uh, I don't know how well you can make out the health, but it's very high. It's about at the U, and he's been being hit for. Quite a while, I would say. Okay. He's got Hurricane Fisher and me hitting him, and two Dire Wolves. And his health is only going down at an average rate. I wouldn't say it was going down very quickly. Right. You see what I mean about taking about one at a time. <laughs> Oh, about this part. Yeah, Minions of Destruction, probably 10 videos. Bail, probably 10 videos. This could go on for a while. Right, one down. And I'm bloody injured now. Um, okay. Right, one of you. Just one. Please. Not all of you. All of you at once will kill me. I know that's your ultimate goal here, but it's really not mine. This is the real reason for trying to kill them one at a time, not one at a time, killing everything. These things, you have to run away from them. I would not be able to survive if I had to fight other things along with these. I'm barely surviving just fighting these. 
I don't have a town portal scroll uh, active even. Okay, 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 right. And go. And of course it would be the big one, wouldn't it? The one that could probably melt me just by thinking it. And apparently can also poison me. Forgot about that quality of it. Probably because it's not very nice quality of it. Oh good, there's another one here. You know, I was hoping to get this one on his own for a while, I can maybe take him out. But, not if there's more than one of them. In fact, no, I can't even take him out, he's killing me. And I'm running out of potions. I don't, well, I'm not quite running out of time. I'm starting to run out of time. Ow. Stop poisoning me. Also stop running out of mana. Okay. See if I can lure them away. <laughs> just a little bit so when I go through the portal coming back, they're not just standing there waiting for me. They're gonna be standing there waiting for me anyway, but what can you do? Uh, uh, there we go. It's ridiculously difficult to kill them. <laughs> I feel there was a reason why I repressed the memory of these things. Apparently it's because they can kill me repeatedly in the face. And going back. See if I can't do them the favour of where oh, there they are. I wasn't disappointed to have lost them, I must clarify that. Blisters <laughs> right. over there. As long as I don't move, he shouldn't come over. And I should get free reign over this one, which is frozen. And since it's frozen, free reign from a henchman it means to just keep hitting it repeatedly without being damaged. Okay, one down. No, I'm not ready to take on Mister the Tormentor. Let's just leave him there. See if we can find another one. Right. The system appears to be working better now. <laughs> it's still not a great system, but it's working better than it was. Because let's say it, it wasn't working. Right, lost the ravens, that's fine. Not lost anything else. Keep it frozen, that's fine. It's a good strategy. No, oh, two more. Can I take two at a time? Probably not. Probably not, but it appears I'm going to have to try. If I keep them frozen, I can take two at a time. As long as they stay frozen, they can't damage me or my henchmen. If I sat down in my henchmen, I have to resummon them, which takes up time. Which will eventually lead to them being unfrozen repeatedly. It's really a vicious circle. Right, they're frozen. That's good. Well, this one appears to not want to stay frozen. That one, it seems to be fine with being frozen. I think it's because my henchman's shooting him, actually. Yeah. Okay, the common factor is my henchman freezes things. I thought it was me. Now I don't feel important. Well, I am important. I'm keeping everything alive and keeping the henchman summoned. Uh, List of the Tormentor, you can stay out there. Are there any left in here? Yeah, yeah, you're laughing, but you only have one minion left. I mean, it doesn't actually say, okay. So I just have to go back and find List of the Tormentor and try and kill him. I'm going to die. Right, where is he? There he is. That's why he's difficult. He doesn't stay frozen. But that's why He also appears to heal because he's no longer as injured as he was when I last fought him. But that's fine, just keep whacking on him, it'll be fine. Shame he doesn't freeze, but alas, I need to heal again. Oh, 
okay. I think I can take him out. We should be fine. There should be no more, more uh, issues. Other than, you know, the Wolf Commission board coming after me for killing so many of them. Well, it's not my fault. It's him, really. I'm just summoning them and, you know, not stopping them. Well, I'm trying to stop him. In theory, I'm trying to intervene repeatedly by hitting him with my axe, but he doesn't seem to be working. Or, if it is, he's not phased by it in the slightest. Come on, you can die. It's not going to take much more effort for you to die, so you can do it. Ow. When I said you can die, I didn't secretly mean I can die. That wasn't my meaning there. Run out of MP. Oh, I thought I'd have to go back to town. I have a feeling he heals when you leave, so that was just going to be awful. Right. So, if I go back to town now, I can get healed and stuff and things. And resummon it with him. Um, it's also a good time to end the video, so I will end this video, and when I come back next time, I will go and try and take on Bale. I have a bad feeling about this, but pressing on, I will be back next time. This has been my 85th Diablo 2 Let's Play video, and I shall be back.